<laughs> That's my question. I want to know, but I think I know. Because we did go there, and and that's the way it happened. And, and if it didn't happen, it's nice to know why it didn't happen. So in the future, if we want to keep doing something, we need to know why something stopped in the past that we wanted to keep it going. Good evening folks and welcome to Alien Addicts. Holy moly. What's going on? What is going on? Is Buzz just getting a little bit old and finally telling the truth that we didn't go to the moon and never did? Or is he maybe just made a mistake and a sly of tongue? I don't know. It's the answer. For anybody out there, I me, me and my dad have had a discussion about whether we went to the moon or not. And my dad, fucking hell, he went crazy at me. He went, ah, oh, for fuck's sake, Oliver. Of course he went to the moon, lad. I saw it on TV. Well... Yeah, I, saw, I also saw 2001 Space Odyssey. That were done before the land on the moon. But do I think we went to the moon? Yeah, I think we went to the moon. I think... I'm, well, I'm going to reverse here. So, th this is an interview you're seeing where this little girl, Zoe, who's interviewing Buzz Aldrin, um, it's actually, it's not recent. This is from back in September, September 5th, 2015. You know, uh, and it was done at the National Book Festival in Washington, DC. So, it's, it's been out there for ages. It's just somebody's now all of a sudden spotted it and they're like, here we go. And I tell you something, the flat earth theorists, they will be going crazy over this. And I'm not a flat earth hater, before you start. I, I'm open to all options. Do I know what's up there in the sky? No, I haven't got a clue. Do I know if there's aliens on the moon? Do I know if the moon's made out of cheese? I do not know. If, it's, if I found it was made out of cheese, I fucking love cheese. But this, this interview is probably gonna start going viral. And I, I kinda wanna just it's not to debunk it. I'll tell you something that's really interesting though. So I wanted to see what he said. So I put Google Translate. So you know the uh, not YouTube Translate. And it translates the little girl but it doesn't translate Buzz Aldrin. Fun up there. <laughs> but that doesn't mean I like to see the fish. <laughs> Long time. Why has nobody been to the moon in such a long time? <laughs> That's not a, an eight year old's question. <laughs> That's my question. I want to know, but I think I know. Because we didn't go there and. Why would not translate Buzz Aldrin. I mean, it's is it because he's doesn't understand what he's saying. He's really good translator. He understands what I'm saying half the time, and I'm a Yorkshireman. So I'd love to know, guys, in the comments below, if you think we didn't go to the moon. Explain yourself. Don't just say I we didn't go. Give me the actual explanation. Don't don't make it like. 10 pages because I'm dyslexic and I'm like sometimes when you put something down it's like Jesus Christ it's taking some work here for my brain um, now just just briefly explain what, I don't know if you're a flat earth theorist or you know geocentric 
or whatever. Yeah, we just can't go because of the the Van Allen belts. Is that what they call them? Yeah, you can't go because of them, and that's what you think. And you just think it was all just a the space race, and you think Stanley Kubik um, helped them fake it. Uh, the interview, by the way, is fake with uh, Stanley Kubik. That's not actually real. So, if any of you say, oh, I've seen the interview, like you said before, have you seen the interview with Stanley Kubik? That's not actually Stanley Kubik. It's fake. Okay. Anyway. Let me know in the comments whether you think... I, I haven't really got much about this. It's not a fucking debunk. I can't debunk it. It's just... I kind of had to comment on it because... I've invested. I've invested money into NASA. Buying this beauty here. Look at this. Oh, just let me move my monitor up because I'm... There you are. It's a beast. The beast. I'm joking. Don't get excited. I'm, I'm not Illuminati. Though I have a friend that is Illuminati. Heathley from Lions Ground, yeah. He tries to deny it. But he is. Guys, I'll be honest with you. The more and more I see about everything that's going on now in the world, all this fucking social media shite, YouTube, yeah, that's the same. Everything is going to be pulled to pieces over time. People might one day decide the fucking world to square. You know, it's three dimensional or whatever. The, the point is, yeah, people will pick out certain bits in videos. What's the full interview with this little girl? It's, you know, it's, it's quite interesting. Um, it reminds it reminds me of like me, me granddad when he was alive speaking to me about stuff because he would like in his speech sometimes he would tell me about something that didn't quite make sense but he wasn't lying to me and that's the only way I can look at it with Buzz um, so I mean I would like to 100% say yes they went to the moon but I wasn't there I wasn't on the spaceship the rocket you know I wasn't on the space shuttle I, I didn't go myself so do I know no but you can have faith and that's all it is at the minute anyway guys I don't know what's up there one day hopefully probably will probably have snuffed it by then um, but yeah who knows you gotta you gotta look to the stars that's what you gotta do keep your ears open eyes peeled look for them UFOs if you see UFOs send them to me alien addict tweet me or whatever email me <sighs> right good night god bless mind the bugs don't bite like and share and subscribe you sexy bastards why don't you swear on the Bible that you walked on the moon? Why don't you swear on the Bible that you walked on the moon? I've got to you to tell him to get out of here. This is a hotel. We'll call right, the police. We, we pay. Come on in not, here. We'll call the police. You like that? Why don't you swear on the Bible that you walked on the moon? I, it doesn't, sir. I, don't, I have nothing to do with this. We okay. cannot solicit on this property. We just paid right to now. rent out the penthouse to shoot up there. So. You can't solicit like this, I just keep, keep shooting. Alright, well then I'd go through my measures. Yeah. You gotta keep shooting, man. Okay, well, you can put it on your shoulder, don't be shy. Come with me, bud. You really like it, don't you? You're the one who said you walked on the moon when you didn't. Calling the kettle black, if you ever thought of it. Saying I misrepresented myself. Get away from me. You're a coward and a liar and a thief.